Hi, I'm Bernice. Welcome to my podcast, In My New Brain. Today, we're going to be talking about something I saw on social media, which is apparently Florida is putting a ban on talking about sexuality in school. And I saw on social media, there was a lot of mixed comments. You know, I'll let you get a comment to see what's going on. There was a lot of mixed comments. You know, some people are on board, some people are against it. My opinion that well sexuality I know in one opinion was well they're too young so the thing is that's where ignorance come in which is why we need to be educated in school at home somewhere because sexuality is don't just not one of those things that automatically comes with puberty sometimes people are self aware of their sexuality a lot be, you know what before puberty that's why there needs to be some kind of education about it i'm not saying you have to go in full detail talking about the things that involved i'm just saying the basis of it you know because like i said like some people are self-aware at a young age about their sexuality whether they like opposite gender or they like the same sex gender so kids need to know about and then another thing was that well it should be taught at home well some kids don't have the luxury of having open minded parents or even midway open minded parents that will talk about this so there are a lot of children out there who won't learn about sexuality until they're out in the world and they're bombarded with it and don't know what to do or they turn into an ignorant a lot of they become ignorant and stupid like a lot of people are in the world when it comes to sexuality talking about no reels all in your head you know a lot of other things that people say prejudice you know become prejudiced and stereotypical and all that that's why that's why we need to be talking about it you know um yeah Another thing is, you, they may a ban, but they can't exactly speak for all parents. Some parents are actually would be actually okay with that. I feel like maybe they should take into account those parents that would be okay with that because there are parents out there who acknowledge the fact they're uncomfortable when it comes to stuff like that because they themselves are not well knowledge on the, the subject of sexuality and the community lgbtq community they're not well versed on the community they don't know much about it so they prefer someone at school a teacher professional someone who actually know what they're talking about to teach your kids some kids would actually prefer that I know when I was in high school, we had a sex education slash drug class, and we had to send out a form to our parents that just, you know, they gave them permission that, you know, would give permission for us to be, you know, present when it happened, you know, when it talked about, when it was talked about, you talked about, and if your parents didn't give you permission, you went somewhere else that is a method you know because yeah like i said there were parents out there i feel like they're speaking for all parents and not all parents but they're not they're not speaking for all parents there are some parents out there who who are open-minded and would like their kids to be educated on that whether it be at home or at school or both you know but like i said not all kids have the luxury of having open-minded parents or midway open-minded parents to communicate with stuff like that so i know a lot of people think well should be talking about it well that's if it's even being talked about those type of things are even being talked about at home for a lot of kids it's not being talked about it's being hush hush with the other rug like it doesn't exist it's not talked about it doesn't exist type of home household so for those kids who may be self-aware at a young age that's gonna really mess them up because no one So a class like that would be helpful for kids like that. They have a safe place to go talk to about it, talk to maybe even fellow peers to talk to about it. So a class like that would be helpful, knowing, you know, 
kids, no parents, no, so parents can be educated right along with the kids, because, you know, I know what I in school, if I learned something new, I told my mom about it, she didn't know, so, when I was young and I was a kid, yeah, I um, told my mom about there was something that I learned at school, she didn't know, that she didn't learn at school, so, kids being educated can actually help adults being educated, and like I said, a safe place for kids who may not have the type of environment where they can talk They can have a safe place to talk about. So I feel like you are missing a lot of kids who may want to talk about. There are a lot of kids out there who may want to talk about in a good way for them to separate the ads. It may be a fantasy world. It could be a phase. Fantasy phase. All that is a good way. A safe place for them to figure that out. Okay, when I'm feeling this is what I'm feeling. It's real. When I feel, oh, okay, well, maybe it's not real. Maybe, you know. Just because I saw someone on TV and I thought it was cool. Something like that. A safe place. Like I said, they, if kids are in an environment where these things are talked about, they're not going to know how to handle the situation. So, just assume it is going to be talked about, you're messing up a lot of kids. Like I said, there are a lot of kids out there who grew up in super religious homes. And they're not going to talk about stuff like that. Unless they're open-minded religious people, maybe religious, but they're open-minded to outside ideas, you know, you know. But if they're not, then if kids are missing out on educating about things, they need to be prepared for it at some point. Because at some point, they can be on the real world, be exposed to different sexuality, different sexes, all type of different sexes out there. Be exposed to that, and they're not gonna know what to do because no one talked to them about it. What about those kids? What about the kids who actually want to know about something and want to get about that, who feel like they may be part of that community? What about those kids? I feel like they really are just the black kids, and they're not helping the situation. But if you have my car, I just feel like you're going backwards more than to instead of going backwards. But we're going backwards to the forward because education helps. We got enough problems in the world, and one of the reasons is ignorance. When it comes to sexuality, and sexuality is sexism, you know, sexism is racism. Then we need to educate more. Those problems go down tremendously, but it's stuff like that. When bands on stuff like that, that not helping to make things better. Especially in school. Yeah, a lot for a lot of kids. Like I said, that's a safe place from the household. Especially if you're in the house, it's not going to learn from school. The problem is a safe place for them at the moment. A safe place. So, school is acting like home. Kids don't have a safe place to go. Just, like I said, you're limiting the education that's actually needed in this world. More definitely need to know because there's one problem we have is people are ignorant about so many things and it shows like sexual and it shows and bands like banning talking about it, 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 not mm, it's gonna cause something to happen. Talking about it makes the kids more aware of the world they live in. Talking about it is going to make them work and work. They're not going to be prepared for when they are in school. They are. <laughs> that talking about it is not helping them. They're not going to be mentally and emotionally prepared for all the time. Sorry, you know. You know, you know, you know, you know, you know. So I just feel like we need to do better. We need that. I hate to talk to you today. Like I said, they're speaking for everybody. I know not everybody feels like that. Maybe I hate for people that feel like that. But not everyone feels like that. Then, like I said, there were some parents out there who prefer their kids be educated at school because, like I said, they, they know how to affect their academic and stuff like that. They prefer that. So I feel like you really miss a lot of kids up. Like I said, sexuality is not a PV thing, it just happens.
been listening to the APUD, not everyone. Sometimes we have to list a lot of you know. That's why education for kids is important. For those kids who are suffering at an early age, like, because not everybody comes out. I mean, they come out when they're older to people, but to themselves, they may come out early you know, to themselves. Like, come out to yourself. Hold yourself difficult hold it in bulk right I can't be very sure you do better because I said for it's a fine example that for it being a fine example how the world is going backwards and so forth it's a lot of things we need to